the rate constant for a certain reaction is k equal to 2.50 times 10 to the negative 3 second raised to negative 1. If the initial reactant concentration was 0 0.500 molar, what will the concentration be after 4 minutes? So this is an integrated rate law problem. And as you can see from the unit of the rate constant, second raised to negative 1, this tells us that the reaction is first order. So we will use the integrated rate law of a first order reaction. So if you can recall, the integrated rate law for a first order reaction is ln of the final concentration that's equal to ln of the initial concentration minus the rate constant times time. Okay. So in the problem, we are given the initial concentration, which is 0 0.500 molar. Okay, so that's ln of 0 0.500 molar minus k, the rate constant given, is 2.50 times 10 to the negative 3, second raised to negative 1. So that's 2.50 times 10 to the negative 3. Second raised to negative 1 is also per second. So that's just the same as per second. So that's our rate constant times our time is four minutes okay since our time is in minutes and our rate constant is in second to the negative one we need to convert our time first to seconds so four minutes if you multiply four by 60 since there are 60 seconds in one minute so four times 60 that's equal to 240 seconds. And then we solve the right side of the equation using the, our calculator. So ln 0 0.500 minus 2.5 times 10 to the negative 3 times 240. So ln of A is equal to negative 1.293. Okay, so how do we get rid of the ln so that we can solve for the final concentration? So what do you do to get our final concentration? So to remove the ln, that's E raised to whatever is on the other side. So E raised to negative 1.293. And if you solve that in your calculator, E raised to negative 1.293 that's equal to 0 0.274 and since this is final concentration the unit is molar so the answer to this question is 0 0.274 molar